Hi, it's Matt from Hollands. Um, just going to grab a pair of the Blundstone 585s, one of our best-selling dealer boots. Uh, they should be somewhere around here. There they are. Oh, excellent. Um, take them up on the Mez and we'll uh, talk to you a little bit more about them. Blundstone are an Australian brand, originally from Tasmania, set up in 1870. So there's two pairs on the table. Uh, the pair here are my pair from home. Um, I've actually got two pairs of them. A great kind of like tough leisure work boot for around the farm, in the pub, uh, on the way back from the shoot. We've got a full upper um, leather uh, unit here with, it's a, it's a new book leather, um, which gives you the ability to um, care for it for a, a prolonged period of time. We've got a section on the website we can give you some guidance and advice about that as well. It's got the elastic gusset here, um, which is quite a, it's quite a strong elastic, um, and I think over time it hasn't degraded on my pair at all. Um, my pair is still, I would say, very, very similar to brand new, and I've worn these every day for a year or so now. We've got the pull-on tabs on the front and back, which are really useful um, if you sometimes struggle getting them on and off or you're doing it in a hurry. Sole unit, uh, some big features on that. Um, we've got the TPU outer sole. Uh, and the PU midsole. Uh, it's oil and acid resistant as well. So around the farm, when you're working with chemicals and bits and pieces, you don't have to be as cautious and the, the rubber wool is a bit is a bit more durable as well. Once sort have of designed the boots with comfort in mind and they've really developed that technology over a, pr a prolonged period of experience. Um, and I think they've really nailed it down with this pair. So great product all around and the key features really stand up um, with everyday wear and uh, yeah we'd highly recommend them here at Holland's. I've had them for about a year now and I've, I would say initially I, I didn't wear them too much I was slowly breaking the boot in but then really became my daily driver. I would say in terms of wear and comfort they've worn really well. There was a bit of a stage where I'd kind of not looked after them too well they looked a bit tired because I was wearing them every day but then I kind of put the effort and time aside to take them, give them a good clean up. Caring for the boots is something that you've really got to consider as well. So I've used a real mixture of products on here. I've used what Blundstone recommends, so some of their renovating cream. I've also used uh, Dubbin from Hogs of Fife, uh, something that we've stopped for quite a long time and really versatile product that can, you can use on a wide range of footwear. The way the leather's kind of treated on these boots, I think it's really important to evenly distribute if you're going to use Dubbin um, and you need to go through that process. And we'll probably do another video on how to care for them and and show you how we apply the the dubbing or any any products in, in in that regard um but in terms of my experience with these boots i think they're great um i've worn them to work worn them in the warehouse here when we've got busy in winter sizing on these dead straightforward you don't need to convert anything with it being an australian brand the the sizing is the same as the uk i'm a uk 10 uh, and these fit me perfectly these are a size 10 as well so the blundstone 585s really great versatile hard wearing boot um, from Blundstone, a great brand as well. Uh, at Holland's, we'd really recommend them. Uh, if you've got any questions, reach out to us. But yeah, the Blundstone 585.